The rhythm in jazz takes off on a real departure from the rock beat. In jazz, the kick and snare are relieved of their steady timekeeping duties. This role is basically transferred to the ride cymbal. And the way the ride cymbal plays the subdivision is perhaps the most important element in defining the way that the band swings. The ride cymbal plays a swung eighth note pattern, which at its most basic can be counted as one, two, and three, four, and one, two, and three, four, and one. Now, off of this basic pattern, the drummer can create different permutations. For example, one, two, and three, and four, one, two, and, and, and one, two, and three, four, and, and two, three, four, and. Sometimes you can identify a drummer just by the sound of their ride cymbal pattern. The hi-hat in this style more or less takes over the role of the snare drum. The drummer typically will open and close the hi-hat on the second and fourth quarter note with their foot. This frees up the kick and snare to play around with the beat. The kick and snare drum are liberated in this style from typical patterns. The role they play is a comping role. Comping is a term used in jazz for accompanying. And the different rhythms played on the kick and snare are often inspired by listening to the other musicians in the band and interacting with them. Kick and snare are just as likely to land on upbeats as they are on downbeats. Take a listen to this following example of a jazz swing drum groove. We'll start with the ride cymbal playing a somewhat consistent swing pattern. Then I'll bring in the kick so you can see how it can play around the ride cymbal part. And finally, I'll bring in the snare to see how all three components work together. In this style, one of the reasons why the drums are able to loosen up is that the double bass typically plays the quarter notes. This is called a walking bass line, and sounds something like this. You can hear that the walking bass provides a sense of solidity. It not only provides a harmonic framework for the other musicians to play over, but also acts as a timekeeper that allows the drums to get loose. The ride cymbal is the main timekeeper in the jazz groove. The kick and snare are liberated in jazz to play more of a comping role. Comping is the jazz term for accompanying. The walking bass line provides the quarter note foundation for the jazz groove. 